This is a next gen pump from Little Giant. It's a model VCMX20 ULS. It has a two year warranty on it. This pump is a pump that was designed with the input of contractors at uh, Little Giant. They did a survey of 100 contractors and took the top 10 suggestions and built it into this pump. Overwhelmingly, contractors asked for an easier to install and easy to service pump. So the mounting bracket was changed from the traditional hang tabs that are normally located on the corners of the tank to this exter or, uh, separate piece. It's made out of a stainless steel material and this would be screwed onto the side of the furnace or ductwork and uh, then the pump just hangs on that from this little, in this little slot that's on the tank. That slot would be on both sides so if you wanted to rotate the pump 180 degrees you could do that real easy. This is easier to install. You got keyhole uh, screw openings, and on the outside of the pump, um, we've located a what we call a test lever. When you depress this, it raises the float. It activates the motor, so you can verify that you you've got power and that the pump is working. Also, before servicing this pump, you can run the motor, and it would uh, evacuate the uh, leftover condensate that would collect down in the bottom of the tank. Makes it so you don't end up spilling that on yourself. When you go to clean one of these pumps, service it basically is cleaning it. Uh, you're going to have to carry it away to some place and, and wash it out. So you're going to have to disconnect your discharge tubing. Um, normally you would have to cut off the tube because you're not going to be able to pull a vinyl tube that's been on this barb fitting for a long time. So you'd have to cut that and then remove the vinyl tube that's stuck on the check valve. But in this case it's a quarter turn. You just turn it out and you can let this hang. Uh, the it is a check valve, so the condensate that's in the line would remain in the in the line. You don't have to try to pull it off and quit, put it down here in the tank and collect it there. The safety switch is a separate piece. This can be be pulled off and let that hang. Unplug it, lift it off of the uh, the furnace. You can take it apart without any screws. Um, clean it, put it back together, put it in place, and pop the uh, check valve back in. Snap that in, put your safety switch back on, plug it in, hang it on your bracket, and um, basically you do this all with the, the tools that God gave you, you with your bare hands. <clears throat> it comes with a little parts bag that has rubber feet on it. In a lot of cases, the pump might be located on the floor now with condensate discharge from uh, furnaces being a lot lower. It might make sense to put it on the floor. So these rubber feet provide an opportunity to eliminate any vibration. Uh, walking around any sound that it might make from vibrating on the floor. Some other cool features, it has a two-year warranty. There's a fan right here keeps the motor cool during operation which should extend the life of the pump. Easy to, easy to install, easy to service, and it's also a pretty good looking pump.